Welcome back. You're watching the news right here on CNN News 18. We're taking you now to breaking news coming in from the Supreme Court as it gets five new judges. The images on your screen are of the swearing-in ceremony taking place. These are newly appointed justices of the Supreme Court of India. You remember just a day ago, the government cleared the Collegium's December 13, 2022 recommendation to appoint five new judges to the Supreme Court. Let's go over to my colleague Ananya to understand more. Ananya, could you name each of these judges for us and tell us about each of their backgrounds and notable judgments, please? Well, uh, these are the five new judges that the Supreme Court has just brought. Uh, this was uh, former uh, Rajasthan Chief uh, Justice, uh, uh, in fact, Pankaj Mithal, Patna High Court Chief Justice uh, Sanjay Karol, Manipur High Court Chief Justice P.V. Sanjay Kumar, Alabad High Court Chief Justice Manoj Mishra, and Asuruddin Amanullah, who is a judge of uh, the Patna High Court. Uh, so definitely these five new judges for the top court would bring up uh, the sanction strength of the topmost court of the country to 32, leaving just two vacancies at the topmost court of the country. This would be a big boost for the Indian judiciary and uh, how the cases in the Supreme Court would be dealt with. It would also be uh, something that could hit to the, uh, the pendency of the country. And, uh, you know, uh, Toya sources have told CNN News 18 when this development had taken place very, very clearly that these uh, appointments, these recommendations weren't clear under any kind of a pressure, uh, though it is a lengthy process and requires the approval of various constitutional authorities like the Prime Minister and the President who can't actually be put under a particular timeline and that's the reason why even the Attorney General of India, Mr. K Mr. Uh, R. Venkatramani had in the collegium hearing on uh, Friday had informed the topmost court of the country that a particular timeline cannot be set to answer these collegium recommendations and at this point of time we are seeing that five more judges for the topmost court of the country are here and they are taking oath at the Supreme Court, sir. Uh, auditorium in the annex building what is being uh, administered by the Chief Justice of India, Mr. Dhananjay Yashwan Sachandachur, and definitely this would be a big boost for the Indian judiciary. Go ahead. Walk us through, Ananya, some of the notable judgments we may have seen come through from, you've said there are five judges being sworn in today. Well, uh, you know, Toya, uh, these people have dealt with a lot of cases. In fact, uh, the Patna High Court Chief Justice was uh, one of those who are dealing, who was dealing, in fact, uh, with the cases relating to the Bihar Hush tragedy. Uh, Sanjay Karol is somebody who's uh, also a very, very renowned uh, uh, jurist. Apart from that, uh, uh, Mr. Pankaj Mithal has also dealt with a slew of cases in Rajasthan. Um, he's also dealt with various matters relating to child marriages as well. Uh, at the same point of time, we have to uh, also see as to how would they add up to, in fact, uh, the Supreme Court of India. Because remember that uh, many of these judges are from the high courts which are less represented. And in fact, if you remember, when, in fact, uh, the Chief Justice of India had also given out these recommendations and the Collegium had given out these recommendations, the Collegium had in its mind that a representation from all of the high courts should be there at the topmost of the country. And that's the reason why we are seeing these diversity of judges coming in from various parts of uh, the country and various high courts of the country. Definitely uh, diversity coming in for the top court and we might see that a new minds can bring in new justice delivery to the system and also uh, reaching out to the people would also become much easier as more judges would actually hit on the pendency. That is one of the most important aspects and one of the most okay. disgraced aspects of All the right. Indian Ananya, judiciary. Ananya, thank you. I do need to move to some particularly important news we've got coming in right now 